Okay. Now, all anybody who has anything touch, please. Whether it's Nintendo DS or iPhone or iPod touch, you know, or even these fake little knockoffs, you know. They always talk, you know, you need a stylus. And there's always somebody who, and I see these videos, and I'm pretty much the same on YouTube. They all say, well, you take a pen, and, and I've heard two variations of the whole pen. You take a pen and you ink this out, and I'm going to get cross out in a minute here. And you use this itself, this little. Or, one I heard, you take this off and use the little plastic case that the pen came in. But a common question that was used on both of these videos. On YouTube and McAfee and a bunch of others. Was people asking a legit question that never got an answered? That question was Will this scratch the screen? Yes, it will. What do you use the pen? This little cap part that's going to scratch. So the question, you know, you know, a lot of people are like, well, Simple. How do you make one that won't scratch? Use a pencil. Use this eraser tip. Sharpen it to a point. Use it. I did. Problem was, create a lot of eraser residue. So, that tossed that out. Now, at various stores where you have to sign, they have stylus. Um, let's see, Walgreens have one. Not Walgreens, yeah. Pennies or Belts one. And I touched the tip of it and I noticed it felt like an eraser. But it wasn't like you couldn't erase a uh, pencil marker. So I thought, well, I need something that is soft to the screen that I can poke the screen with and be all right with. Then I realize this. This. You can get these at dollar store. You can get like 200, 500 of them for like an hour. And this one, excuse me, this will never scratch your screen. This won't. If you, uh, Turn them on, on, that's what I'm doing. You can get these little plastic ones. They're like dollar store, dollar tree, dollar everything. No, no, it's all over the place. Drug stores. They're great. They're fantastic. They kind of, you know, thin. But if you know a doctor, Somebody who works around doctors or work in a uh, drugstore, you can get a better alternative. This you can get those. I don't know what they call. I call them giant Q-tips. They're like this, but they're really long and they're wood instead of plastic. Got this upside down. I'm gonna show you if I can get this thing pointed. Okay that screen. Now this this <laughs> you gotta excuse me I gotta, I'm doing this like backwards via the camera anyway <laughs> okay just bear with me on it. This actually Okay, this still ain't doing it for my end. Okay. Anyway, this works, but if you want to make this like a longer point, because 
I think Nintendo DS style is a lot longer than this. This. Another thing you can find at Dollar Store. You can find this literally anywhere. Just take this part. But where the cotton starts to build, you just tape it to it. And you'll have an instant stylus. It won't look fabulous, but it'll work. If you want, you can kind of tape it or glue this, put another one together, and wrap ribbon or, you know, paper or something. And nobody will know. It's cheap. You don't scratch your screen. Oop. <laughs> Sorry. And uh, it works. So, don't worry about scratching your screen and screen protectors and pens and pencils that you use for drawing and writing. Q-tip. Popsicle stick. At the most Q-tip. 500 of these. Never run out. If you lose this, guess what? There's a whole box of them. There's a whole bag of them. There's stores full of them. So, simple, simple craft. And also kind of neat. The great thing about them. They clean. <laughs> You can clean the corners with it too. So just remember, stylus of the best.